and we honor you. You are wonderful. You are worthy, O Lord. You are wonderful. You are worthy, O Lord. We give you glory, Lord. And we honor you. For you are wonderful. You are worthy, O Lord. You are wonderful. You are worthy, O Lord. We give you glory, Lord. We give you glory, Lord. And we honor you. Lord, we give you glory, Lord, and we honor you, for you are wonderful, you are worthy, O Lord, you are wonderful, you are worthy, O Lord, yes, Lord, take glory, Father, take glory, Son, the glory, glory, Holy Ghost, now and forevermore, forevermore, take glory, glory, Father, take glory, Son, come take glory, glory Holy Ghost, now and forevermore, forevermore, take glory, Father. Take glory, Son. Take glory, Holy Ghost. Now and forevermore. Yes, Lord. Can never, never change. Our God will never, never change. Jesus will never, never change. He is the same forever. He can never, never change. He will never, never change, and never, never change. Jesus the same forever. Hallelujah, he can never, never change. Hallelujah, he will never, never change. Amen, amen, he can never, never change. Jesus the same forever. Our Father, our Father, who are in heaven, amen, hallowed be thy name, our Father, our Father, who are in heaven, amen, hallowed be thy name, hallowed be thy name, Hallowed be thy name, hallowed be thy name, hallowed be thy name. Begin to worship the Lord tonight, begin to magnify his holy name, begin to glorify him. He's the Lord God of heaven and earth, is a God that changes not, is a God that never fails, is our Father, is our Savior. The God that says, Call unto me, and I will answer you and show you great and mighty things. Is a God that sees and knows from the beginning even unto the end of our lives. He sees them, He knows them all. He holds the keys to our lives. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise this God. He's worthy. The Lord is worthy. The Lord is mighty. The Lord is excellent. Hallelujah. Great is the Lord and greatly to be praised. King of kings, Lord of lords, so worthy, O Lord, the invisible God, the only wise God. We bless and adore you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your name, Lord. In Jesus' name, we have given thanks. Amen. Amen. One more time.
I just want, to, want us to think of the goodness of God for our lives and just begin to adore him, just begin to glorify him. He is worthy to be magnified. He is worthy to be honored and adored. Let us magnify him again. Think of the goodness of God for your life and praise him tonight. Think of the goodness of God for your life and bless his life for the life of your children, for the life of your loved ones, for your own very life, how God has been merciful, how God has been faithful, how God has been marvelous to you and your family. Begin to praise his name. Uh, thank you. Magnify him. Lord, you are forever faithful. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jehovah. Oh, look, Benjamin. Daddy, I thank you. Daddy, I thank you. Daddy, I thank you. Daddy, I bless you. Daddy, I glorify you. Hallelujah. 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 The God that doeth what no man can do. How excellent is your name in all the earth. Be thou exalted, Father. Be thou glorified, Lord. Daddy, we thank you. Daddy, we praise you. Daddy, we exalt and adore you. King of kings, Lord of lords, the soon coming king, the prince of peace. Jehovah Lord, you are worthy. Jehovah Lord, you are mighty. Jehovah Lord, you are excellent. Great are you, Lord. Be magnified, Lord. Be exalted, Lord. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we have given thanks. Amen. Amen. One more time this hour, I want us to surrender ourselves into the hands of the almighty God and just say, Father, here I am tonight for your word says that we are two or three are gathered in your name that you will be right there in their midst because you are here tonight and the Bible says that your eyes are pure and cannot behold iniquities of men. And so I plead that you purge and cleanse me from every unrighteousness. Begin to ask God for mercy tonight that the Lord will purge you, the Lord will cleanse you of everything and anything that the accuser of brethren might want to use as a yardstick against you in any way in any form in the mighty name of jesus begin to praise begin to purge yourself tonight in any way in any form that the accuser of brethren might want to you know manipulate in any form in my life father tonight oh lord i come humbly before you Forge me, O oh Lord. Cleanse me, O oh Lord. Wash me thoroughly from my iniquities and cleanse me from my sin. In the mighty name of Jesus, be merciful unto me, O oh Lord, according to thy loving kindness, according unto thy tender mercies, Lord. Sort out my transgressions. Wash me, O oh Lord, from all unrighteousness. In the name of Jesus, Jehovah, have mercy. Jehovah, have mercy. Ancient of days, have mercy. Daddy, have have mercy, Father, have mercy in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, support me, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. We want to ask, we want to begin to plead the blood of Jesus upon our lives one more time. Begin to plead the blood upon your life. Let the blood of Jesus speak for you. Plead the blood upon your family. Plead the blood upon the work of your hands. Let the blood of Jesus conquer for you and I. Let the blood of Jesus pave way for us where there is no way. Let the blood of Jesus that speaketh better things than every other blood put together begin to counter every blood that is speaking against your life, against my life. Every evil blood, blood of chicken, blood of goats, blood of rams, blood of human beings that are speaking against our lives in any way, in any form, from our foundation, from our generation, from generation to generation. We want to pray that the blood of Jesus that was shed on the cross of Calvary will begin to counter every voice, every blood that is speaking against us, every contrary blood, every contrary, contrary voice. Let the blood of Jesus speak better things and swallow them all up in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, let the blood speak for me. Let the blood speak for my family. I saturate this environment with the blood of Jesus. I soak my home in the blood of Jesus. I soak the work of my hands in the blood of Jesus. I soak my husband in the blood of Jesus. I soak the work of his hands in the blood of Jesus. Every member of my family in Africa, from wherever they are located, oh Lord, in the north, north southwest, and east of Africa, I incubate them in the blood of Jesus. Uh, Father, let the blood avail us in the name of Jesus. Thank you 
you, Father, for the blood that is speaking for us. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. 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 Tonight, we are going to ask that the Lord Almighty will, by the authority he has given unto you and I, that the Lord will pull down every stronghold of the wicked laid against our lives in any way, in any form, begin to pull them down. Say every power from beneath the sea, on the sea, in the land, on the air, on assignment against my prayer tonight, on assignment against my life, on assignment against that which concerns me, by the authority in the name of Jesus, I pull you down tonight. I render your activities in my life useless. Pray for yourself because I'm praying for myself. In the mighty name of Jesus, every contending power against my life, every contending power, every powers of darkness, human agent of darkness, demonic agents of darkness from beneath the sea on the sea, in the land on the air, that he had marked the war against my life. He had marked against my prayers tonight. He yeah, marked against this gathering tonight by the authority in the name of Jesus. I come against you by the power in the blood of the Lamb of God. I pull you down. I render your activities useless in my life, in my family. I declare a decree. It will not stand. It will not prosper. For who is it that speaketh against my life? And it comes to pass when God has not commanded it. Every citadel of wickedness against my life, tonight, against my family, against the work of against my home and marriage, against the fruit of my womb, against my ministry, by the authority in the name of Jesus, I release fire against you born to ashes tonight. I render your activities useless in my life and family. It will not stand, it will not prosper in Jesus name. Amen. 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 Begin to invite the Holy Spirit tonight. Say, Holy Spirit, come in your fullness and power. Take over me completely. For I surrender it all unto you, Holy Spirit. For I know that without you, I am empty. I, without you, I am nothing. Holy Spirit, take your place. Ask the Holy Spirit to help you tonight. Ask the Holy Spirit to help our leader tonight. That as he come to minister, that the power of God will come mightily. The power of God will move mightily. That the Lord Lord Almighty will do what only him alone will do because the Holy Spirit is leading. Holy Spirit, have your way. Holy Spirit, exalt the Father because unto him is the gathering of his people tonight. Have your way, Father. Have your way, Father, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you for accepting to guide us tonight, for accepting to teach us tonight, for accepting to lead us tonight. Blessed be your name forever. Thank you, Jesus. For in Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. Amen and amen. amen. Tonight we want to we want to lift up as many members of this program that are supposed to be here tonight, that wherever they are located, that the spirit of the Lord will go and usher them in, into this meeting tonight, in the name of Jesus, begin to rebuke whatever is holding them bound, whatsoever it is, every spirit of forgetfulness, we come against you tonight, every manipulation of the wicked, to hinder them from receiving the blessing of God tonight, on this mount, oh Lord, we come against you by the authority in the name of Jesus, Satan, we command you to lose your hold from every man, every woman, every boy, every girl that is here marked to receive the blessing of tonight. Wherever they are located, lose your hold from their lives. Holy Spirit, usher them into the gathering of your people tonight. Holy Spirit, bring them in. Let nothing hinder them, Lord. Rather, bring them in, O oh Lord. As many that the blessing of tonight is here marked for, Father, bring them in. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Father, Lord. In Jesus' name name we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Quickly, let's lift up our leader for tonight into the hands of God, that the Lord will guide him, the Lord will lead him, that every word that we proceed out of his mouth tonight uh, will come with power, will come with the backing of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus. Begin to lift him up tonight into the hands of God. Ancient of days, uh, we know that on our own we are empty, Lord. Uh, and so we lift up our leader for tonight, oh Lord, uh, the one that you have here marked, oh Lord, uh, the one that you have chosen tonight uh, to use as your mouth 
peace unto your people. My Lord and my Savior, on his own he can do nothing. And so we lift him up unto you, that you will fill him up, O Lord, that he will decrease and you will increase in him. In the mighty name of Jesus, that you will use him mightily, that you will use his tongue tonight, you will use his mouth tonight, you will use his ears tonight, you will use his eyes tonight, you will use his hands tonight. Every word that will come from him, O Lord, will come from your throne of mercy. In the name of Jesus, tonight as you speak, O Lord, set the captives free, deliver the oppressed, O Lord, save the unsaved, O Lord, bless, O Lord, your children. Father, Lord, encourage the discouraged. In the name of Jesus, we thank you because it is settled. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. Amen, amen and amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, everyone, for coming tonight. I know that a lot of people, they have a lot of engagement on Fridays, but, you know, whatever, uh, for um, as many of us that are here tonight, those are these people that God wants to be here tonight. Those on, uh, on WhatsApp and those of us here on the platform, I thank the Lord for giving us the opportunity to come and worship him again tonight, to come and praise him. He said with thanksgiving, we should make our request known unto him. As we praise the Lord tonight, as we fellowship in this gathering tonight and make our request known unto the Father, he will hear us and he will answer us in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Before our teacher for tonight will come up, I want us to take our team song. After the team song, you will take over, Pastor. Thank you, Jesus. Prayer is the key. Prayer is the key, yes. Prayer is the key, I know. Prayer is the master King Jesus started with prayer and he ended with prayer. Prayer is the master king. Hallelujah. Prayer is the key. I know. Prayer is the key. I know. Prayer is the master king. King Jesus started with prayer, and he ended with prayer. Prayer is the master key. Hey, hallelujah. If you see as I did dance where I sit down, because I know for sure that if there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. Prayer Hallelujah. indeed is the master key. As you pray tonight, hey, you will unlock every door that the enemies are shut against you ah in the name of jesus as we pray tonight the lord will open them in the name of jesus and we will Amen. possess our possessions every door that the enemies open against us that is working against us in any way in any form as we pray tonight the master key will shut them up and they will never be reopened in the name of jesus Amen. thank you Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Take over, sir. Hallelujah. Amen. Let us sing this song together. Amen. The hour has come. The hour has come. The hour has come. Has come, the hour has come, Lord, your name, the hour has come, those that know it, please sing along, I don't know, the hour has come, has come. Father, I decree that tonight, you will do what no man can do. Amen, Lord. Everything that has been rising up, having authority over our lives, because of this tonight encounter, mm. let the heaven raise a standard against them. Amen. The I decree, Lord, that you will bless each and every one of us 
that are under the sound of this program and those that will listen after in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father, because I know it is done. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Very Amen. Quickly, very quickly, let's turn the Bible to the book of Jeremiah 51. Jeremiah 51. Jeremiah 51. Please, sir, if you can exactly. increase your volume a little bit for the sake of Jeremiah, those on uh, WhatsApp. Jeremiah 51, verse 20 to 23. Jeremiah 51, 20 to 23. The Bible says, Thou art my battle axe and weapons of war. For with thee I will break in pieces the nations. Mm. And with thee, I will destroy kingdoms. Amen. Verse 21 says, And with thee, I will break in pieces the horse and his rider. And with <sighs> thee, I will break in pieces the chariot and his rider. Verse 22, with thee, the Bible says in verse 22 also, I will break in pieces man and woman. Mm. And with thee, Will I break in pieces old and young? And Amen. with thee, I will break in pieces the young man and the maid. Verse 23 Amen. and the last, he says, I will also break in pieces with thee, the shepherd and his flock. Amen. And with thee, will I break in pieces the husband man Amen. and his yoke of oxen? Amen. And Amen. with thee, will I break in pieces captains and rulers. Now, time will fail us to explain it one after the other. The Bible says that it's going to make you, God says it will make you a battle axe. Sorry, Somebody, sir, Jeremiah what? Jeremiah 51, verse oh, 20 okay. to 23. Okay, sir. He says, it will make you a battle axe. Somebody that is set on the edge to fight because mm -hmm. there are a lot of battles around. God mentioned 10 things, 10 people, 10 places you're going to fight with. He says you're going to fight with the nation and you bring them down. Mm. He says you're going to fight with kingdoms and you bring them down. Amen. He says even the horses and their riders you bring down. Yes. He will let us to understand that chariots and his rider you mm. will also bring down. He yes. says men and women, there are people also that have gang up themselves together. The Lord says he will use you to tear them in pieces. Amen. I don't want to know the things that have been fighting with you for a long while. The word of the Lord make me to understand that he will make you his battle axe. Yes. And to fight, you will pull down whatever that needs to be pulled down. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. In Matthew 13, verse 25, he said, But while men slept, the enemy came and so us. While men slept, those that were not vigilant, according to 1 Peter 5, 8, the enemy will come and sow. I don't want to know what the enemies have sown in your life. Tonight, as the Lord release the axe in your hands, you will pull down. You will Amen. root out in the Amen. name of Jesus. Amen. The Bible also makes us to understand. In the book of Isaiah 1 verse 15, it says, Behold, I will make you into a new sharp threshing instrument. Having teeth. That's what the Bible says it will make you. In Isaiah 41, verse 15, he said, Behold, I will make you into a new sharp threshing instrument, having teeth, ready to fight, ready to uproot. For you to ascend into that greater glory, you must be a warrior. Mm -hmm. For you to ascend into your greater glory, you must be a warrior because the enemies are always ready to fight. Mm. It is now said for you to take it. That's what the Bible says, right from the days of John the Baptist. Mm. The kingdom of heaven suffered violence. Mm. And it is only those with the violent spirit that mm. take it by force. Hallelujah. I pray to some here tonight, mm. you will take your glory by force. Amen. By the unction of tonight, Every power that have been fighting you, 
you Lord will Jesus. conquer them tonight. Amen. This is what the Bible says in the book of Agai chapter 2. Agai chapter 2, verse 6 to 9. He says, I will shake the heavens. I will shake the earth. He says, he will shake the sea and the dry land. Mm -hmm. And not just that, he will shake the nations. And tonight, God says, the glory of this latter house mm. will be greater than the former. Amen. The glory you have never experienced, mm. the glory you have never seen, the Bible Amen. says tonight you will experience it. Amen. I want you very quickly to lift up your voice and begin to tell him, Father, thank you for the word I heard this night. Father, thank, thank you, you for the word that we have had tonight, Lord. Lord, Lord God of heaven and earth, we thank you. We thank you for the we word that you have sent forth, O Lord. Lord. For your word, the Bible says, O Lord, that you send your word and your word came and healed you the diseases of your people. Father, Lord, Father, Lord, we thank you tonight, O Lord, for the entrance of your word. Your word is here, your word is amen. Your word is powerful, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, thank you for sending your word to deliver us tonight. Thank you to for sending your word to set us free tonight. Blessed be your name, Father. In the Hallelujah. Name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. In Jesus name of the book Amen. of Psalm, Psalm 24, verse 7 to 10. He says, Lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be lifted up in everlasting doors. There was a point in time in the life of the apostles that while in prison, the Holy Ghost came. And when the Holy Ghost came, gates were lifted. Ah, it doesn't need keys. When the Holy Ghost walk with you into battle, you don't need another physical weapon because yes. the Holy Ghost is with you tonight. Every Amen. battle in your life, you will win them. Amen. Lift up your voice and say, powers raging war against me. Powers Power. raging war against me. Tonight. Tonight, your time is up. Lift your time up. is up. In the mighty name of Jesus, every power waging war against me. Tonight, your time is up. In the name of Jesus, pack your bags and baggages and leave because your time is up. Everything that God created have an expiring date. Your time has expired in my life. Every power waging war against my life. Every power waging war against my time is up. Power waging war against my finances, every power waging war against my ministry. Your time is up. Live now and never return. In the name of Jesus, pack your load and go forever. In the name of Jesus, amen. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. Jeremiah 1 10, Jeremiah chapter 1, verse 10. He says, See, I have this day set thee over the nations and over kingdoms. You are going to pray and say, Father, Father every coven of the wicked, every plan of the wicked, every coven of the wicked, every coven of, of the wicked, making decisions against me, making decisions against me, catch fire now, catch fire Make now in the name of Jesus, Jesus. every, every coven of the wicked, making decision against my life, making decision against my home, making decision against my husband's life, making decision against the fruit of my home, in the name that is above every other name, catch fire now, 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 we decree them to catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. In the name of Jesus, let the fire of God burn. Let the fire of God consume them. In the mighty name of Jesus, let the fire of God burn. In the name of Jesus, let it catch fire, Lord. Let it catch fire, Lord. Let it be destroyed, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Every secret power. Every secret power. In any house I have lived in. In any house that I have lived in. Right from my childhood. Right from my childhood. Fighting against me. Fighting against me. By fire. 
Lift up your voice and begin to pray. Catch fire, catch fire, burn to ashes. Every power that is fighting me from the houses that I'm lifting, oh Lord, from my childhood, my Lord and my Savior. Tonight, oh Lord. I set them, them on fire. fire. Holy Ghost fire. Let the fire of God consume them. Let the fire of God destroy their works. Let the fire of God burn them. In the mighty name of Jesus, let them be destroyed. Let, let them be destroyed. Lord. Every power contending against my life from the houses that I have lived in since the day I came into this world. Father, arise, O oh God. Contend against them. Pull them down. Consume them with your fire. In the name of Jesus. Yes, by the authority in heaven. Jesus, in Jesus' Amen. mighty name we pray. Amen. The book of Luke chapter 10. Luke chapter 10 verse 19. Luke 10 19. It says, Behold, I give unto you power to yes. trade on serpents and scorpion. Yes. Now you're going to lift up your voice and say, Every law of Satan. Every law of Satan. Blocking my promotion. Blocking my promotion. Break by fire. Break by fire in the name of Jesus. Every law of Satan, every law of, of the witches and wizards, every law from the occultic covenant, every law from the marine world, every law from the Babalawo's kingdom that is warring against my life in the mighty name of Jesus. Catch fire. I break such walls. I break such covenant in the mighty name of Jesus. Break in the name of Jesus. Break in the name of Jesus. And we pray. Amen. In the name of Jesus, you're going to Amen. pray and say, Powers are signed to investigate my future. Powers are signed Powers. to investigate my future. By the authority in heaven. By the authority in heaven. Die by fire. Lift Die, by fire. Die by fire. Die by fire. Every power that is assigned in to investigate Every your future, to investigate your glory, to, to investigate your future, to investigate your finances, sort of your finances. To investigate your success, to investigate your testimony, let them die by fire. 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 In the name of Jesus, be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Get your glory. Investigate your joy. That is aside from the land of the sea, from the sea in the land of the air, to investigate my glory, to investigate my destiny, to investigate the fruit of my womb and the blessing of God for my life. Catch fire and burn to ashes. In the name Jesus of name. Jesus. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. You're going to Amen. pray. And say, Investors of evil works. Mm. Inventors of evil works. Listen. Inventors there, of there, evil works. There are enemies that invent evil works in your life. Mm. You have good plans for the day. But because there are people that are inventing evil, and the evil supersede your good plans. You are going to pray. Inventors of evil works. Every inventor of evil works. In my life. In my life. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the of name of Jesus Christ. Die. Die. Ah, die. 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 Every inventor. Evil inventor. Evil inventor. Evil inventor of sickness. Inventor of waste. Wastefulness. Inventor of turning in circles. Inventors all along. God Almighty, of nearly syndromes in the name of Jesus. What are you waiting for? My God is Let against you. In the name of Jesus, I release the arrow of death against you. Let them die by fire. Let them die by fire. Let them die by fire. In the name of Jesus, let the brimstone of God knock you down. In Jesus' name, amen. In that scripture we read in Jeremiah 51 verse 20, he says, thou art my battle axe. Yes. Now you're going to pray and say, as a battle axe. As a battle axe. I tear in pieces. I tear in pieces. Every evil altar. Every evil altar. Against my life. Lift against my life. In the mighty name of Jesus. Axe, because the Lord has pieces. made me a, 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 a battle axe. By the authority in the name of Jesus. I tear down, O Lord. Every evil altar. Every altar that has been speaking against my life, I tear it down. I tear it down. I tear it down. Because of the Lord, the Lord Almighty has made me a battle axe. I am 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 a battle axe
to last. And I ask down every altar speaking against my life from my father's house, from my mother's house, from my husband's house, from a strange land, from beneath the sea, from on the sea, from on the land, from among my friends. Every altar speaking against my life. I ask you that. I ask you that in Jesus' name. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. My father, my maker. My father, my maker. Make me a carrier of fire. Make me a carrier of fire. Whatever evil that touches me. Whatever oh. evil that touches me. Be born to ashes. Be born Lift to ashes. Lift up your voice and begin to pray. Make me a carrier of fire. From now on, henceforth, Holy Ghost. Any evil that will touch me. Any power that will touch me. Any demon that will touch me. Let them burn to ashes. Let them burn to ashes. Let them burn to ashes. By the power of the Holy Ghost, we command them to burn to ashes. Whatever is not of God, come In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. The Bible says you are going to break in pieces nations. Yes. Listen, there are powers in nations that doesn't want progress. And because you are from that nation or you are in that nation, you don't encounter progress. You are going to lift up your voice. As a battle axe. As a battle axe. Every altar in the nation I am living in. Every altar in the nations that I'm living in. Fighting my destiny. Fighting my destiny. By the unction of the Holy Ghost. By the unction of the Holy Ghost. I hear you in pieces. I hear you in your pieces. voice and begin to pray. By the unction of the Holy Ghost. Every power is in the unction. In this that I'm living in. In this community that I'm living in. In this state that I'm living in. That is warring against my destiny. That is warring against my rights. That is warring against my testimony. I see them in pieces. That is above every other name. As a battle actor, I pull you down. I destroy your works. I destroy your works. I destroy my family. In the name of Jesus, I destroy evil altar. Warring against my destiny. In the name of Jesus, you will not stand. You will not prosper. Every invisible altar walking against my family. In the we name of Jesus, them in I pull you down. Be destroyed. Catch fire. Be destroyed. In Jesus' name. Amen. As a battle axe that God has made you tonight. Yes. I decree all mm. that you have teared down yes. will never rise again. Amen. By the authority in heaven. Yes, Lord. I don't want to know the powers that have gang up in the nation you are or the mm, powers God. that have gang up in the place of work uh, mm. by the authority of tonight. Yes. The Bible says he has made us a battle axe yes. to tear down in pieces man and yes. woman. Yes. Young and old. I Amen. don't want to know how many they are. I, I decree to tonight. Know. Yes. Every man and woman that have been fighting your destiny, I tear peace. them in pieces. Amen. Amen. By the authority you, in heaven. Yes, Lord. That glory that is hanging, in the because the Bible made me to understand in the Father. book of Adam, it is the glory of the latter house shall be let better, shall be greater. Yes. I decree right now in your the name glory of Jesus. from in the name now henceforth in the name of Jesus. experience greatness. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Every forces around your environment that says, no, you cannot exhibit this power that Father. God has given you tonight. I stand with authority in heaven. Yes. And I raise a standard against them. In Amen. The name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. You are a carrier of fire. Amen. Every evil hand that will stretch to touch you. In the name by of the Jesus. authority in heaven, they Amen. will burn to ashes. Amen. 
I decree from this day forward. Yes, Lord. The Bible says in that same book of Haggai chapter 2, it says in this house, there will mm. be. Yes. I decree mm. every spirit of violence that the, the enemies have been cooking up in every home. In the name of Jesus. Every spirit of problems, the enemies have been cooking up in every home. In the name of I Jesus. I decree in the name of Jesus, let Ta-da. there be peace. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. I know the challenges that have been going on in your family. Ah, the Bible says there shall be peace in this house. Amen. <laughs> and yes, tonight, Lord. I decree that peace upon your family. Amen. Amen. I receive Whatever it. Whatever causing many to shed tears. Whatever mm. that have been causing many to cry. Mm. Ah, tonight, the glory of this house. Mm-hmm. The glory of this house. Mm-hmm. The glory mm-hmm. of this house. Mm-hmm. That surpass tears, that surpass problem. I decree. Let it look at you right now. Amen. Thank you, Lord. On this mount that God is using to bless lives. I speak upon this mount and the flag bearer of this mount. I decree from now henceforth the glory of this mount. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We'll go far and wide. Amen. I decree the glory of this mount from this day forward will go far and wide. Amen. Many who have encountered this mount and Mm. many who will encounter this mount, Mm. they will have testimonies. Amen. I speak upon everyone that will listen to this program letter. I decree mm. in the name of Jesus. All that we enjoy right now, Father, I release to them in full. Amen. I cover each and every one of us with the blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus Christ. Tonight, I decree, let the heaven open your eyes, your spiritual eyes. As you lay down to sleep, let the heaven open your spiritual eyes. Take you to where your glory has been kept. By the authority in heaven, you will tear down that place. By the authority in heaven, you will recover all. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Father, because I know it is done. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Wow. To God be all the glory. Thank you so much, Pastor Samuel. God bless you real good. The Lord who has called you will continue to protect you, will continue to increase his anointing upon your life. He will take you from glory to glory in the mighty name of Jesus. No evil will befall you in your going, in your coming. The Lord will give his angels charge over you in the mighty name of Jesus. Every Amen. word that God speak through you will receive a backing from his throne of grace and signs and wonders will follow in the name of Jesus. Thank you. Amen. God bless you, sir. God bless you. God bless you, sir. That was powerful. Thank you so very much. I am so certain that every one of us are blessed under this unction tonight. You see, I told you, God does not move by crowd. You see? As many that was yeah, marked for this program tonight are here tonight. Hallelujah. And I know, even as our leader for tonight has prayed, as many that will listen to this message after now, ha, ah, the testimony, you know, is sure. Thank you, Jesus. But before we go, uh, there's one revelation that God showed me. I cannot pinpoint which family it was, but the Lord showed me that all of a sudden they noticed that there was a serpent. There was a serpent somewhere in the family. 
and everybody became afraid because they didn't know where the serpent was hiding, but they know that there was a serpent in the house. And so they started looking for the serpent because everybody was scared. And somebody just said, it's like it's on the roof, like in a ceiling. And then they used something to hit the ceiling. And when they hit the ceiling, the serpent came down. Big serpent, black serpent, came down from the, the roof, the ceiling of the house, and dropped somewhere into the house. And they looked for it and looked for it, but they could not find the serpent. That is the trick of the devil. Hmm. One more time, we are going to lift up our voice before, uh, I don't know if uh, Sister Esther Okon can hear us tonight. He will, she will round up this prayer for us mightily. Hallelujah. We are going to pray. Every spirit of serpent, every, be it human serpent, demonic serpent, that the enemies have assigned into our homes to eat our finances, to eat our, our joy in any way, in any form, whatever the enemies have assigned in the form of a serpent, that the fire of God will locate them and consume them, that we destroy the works of the serpentine, every serpentine spirit in our homes, we destroy them in the name of Jesus. Begin to pray concerning serpent. Serpent, serpent represent trick, every trickish human being, be it a friend that want to trick you to destroy you, that want to destroy you in any form, in any way. Father Lord, every serpentine spirit logging in our homes, every serpentine spirit logging in our lives, every serpentine spirit logging in our marriages, every serpentine spirit logging to destroy our children. Father, whatsoever is making us to live in fear in our homes, we release fire against them tonight. Let the fire of God locate and consume in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, when you reveal a thing, Lord, it means that the, you alone have conquered. Father, tonight, oh Lord, we conquer in our lives. We conquer in our homes. We conquer in our midst. Every serpentine spirit, every serpentine spirit on assignment against our lives and homes, against our children, against our spouses, we conquer you tonight by the power in the blood of Jesus. We render your activities useless in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. 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 For one more time before we, our sister, if she's on, um, she can unmute herself and then uh, lead us to pray. But if she's not in a position where she can lead us, I see that we have Pastor Stephen in the house. Pastor Stephen will round it up for us. So, but we are going to pray for every man, every woman that have one problem or the other on this, on this mountain. Many of us, as our faces are different, so is our needs. We have some prayer requests, you know, on ground, but time will not permit us to begin to mention the names of the problems. But we know that we serve a God that hear and answer prayer. We have prayed tonight and we believe God. But one time we want to lift up this every family on this mount that is sick, every family that needs the touch of God in one area or the other in their lives, in the lives of their children, those in prison, those in the hospital, those that are having challenges, financial challenges, that the Lord will visit them. Tonight, the Lord will show himself uh, strong and mighty in their situations. In the name of Jesus, begin to pray like that. Father, in the name of Jesus, we pray for every man, every woman, every boy, every girl at the sound of my voice tonight. Father, Lord God of heaven and earth, wherever our members are located, even those that are not our members that will listen to this program. Father, Lord God of heaven and earth, every challenge that each and every one of us have. Father, Lord, we table it before you tonight. Father, arise, O oh Lord. Father, arise. Lord, you will call upon you that you will answer us. Father, meet us, oh Lord, at the very point of our needs. Father, heal the sick tonight. Father, deliver the oppressed, oh Lord. Father, set the captives free. Father, save the unsaved. Father, supply the needs of the needy. In the mighty name of Jesus, encourage the discouraged, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Daddy, move as only you can. At the end of it all, Lord, let glory and honor return to you. 
you and you alone, Lord. We thank you because you have done it again. Hallelujah to your holy name. Thank you, Father, for in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. It is settled. Sister um, Dustina, are you in the house? Are you in the position to lead us, to round up the prayer for us? Thank you, Lord. Okay, I, I think she's in this pensable. <laughs> Brother, Pastor Stephen, please, can you round up the prayer for us? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The God of heaven that has authority over all humanity. Yes. First of all, we want to say thank you for the vessel that you have used. Thank you, to Lord. Fire thank you, Lord. Thank you, The vessel you have used for tonight's program. Thank Amen. you for as many people that make it to this program. Father, Lord, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Lord of heaven, we want to declare tonight that that vessel will continue to be useful in your vineyard in Jesus' name. Amen. Lord, that vessel will not go down in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. Amen. By the authority bestowed upon me, I decree once again that that vessel will be a terror to the kingdom of darkness in Amen. the mighty name. Amen. Amen. Walk from the enemy that want to bring you down. Amen. I nullify the box of the enemy in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. All that we have uh, spoken, you said, I will say to your hearing, so shall you do unto us. Yes. Amen. I even beyond what we have mentioned in our prayers tonight. But I will walk on our behalf in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Before the end of this Thanksgiving month, Lord, somebody will dance for joy in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. 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 I receive it, Lord. Christ is somebody, somebody beyond your imaginations in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father. I give thanks to God in this month of August. Amen. The Lord fight your battles in Jesus' name. Amen. So for those that are not around even today, the Bible said the hand of God is not shutting, neither is it heavy. I release the same anointing to them wherever they are now in the yes, name of Lord. Jesus. Amen. Amen. Once again, that as you go, you will go in the power of His majesty in Jesus' name. Amen. When we are meeting on Monday, I pray that somebody, somebody will have a testimony to glorify God for the gathering of tonight. In the Amen, name of Lord. Jesus. Amen. Thank you, answers. Thank you, Lord. Mighty name we have declared. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. God bless you, sir. Thank you. And we share the grace in fellowship. May the grace of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, the love of God the Father, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely. Follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever and ever and ever. Amen. Shalom, everyone. Thank you so very much for coming out to pray tonight. 
I know that the Lord has heard and has answered us. It is signed, it is sealed, and it is delivered unto us in the name of God the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go and possess your possessions in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you so much. Thank you, uh, Pastor Samuel. Please stay behind, sir. I, will, I want to talk with you briefly. Thank you, everyone. Program is over. <laughs> I'm going to thank you so much. Thank you, Esther, for coming. Thank you, Beatrice. Thank you, Pastor Iperi. God bless you. Thank you, everyone. Please, Monday is another wonderful time. It promises to be great. Come and be blessed in 